Hi, my name is Katherine Hickson and welcome to my project presentation. Today I will be discussing how technology can be used to support collaborative learning in the classroom. The purpose of my project is to first define collaborative learning, explain the multiple ways it can benefit students, and last, share some ways that technology can be used to support collaborative learning in the classroom. So what is collaborative learning, you might ask? In collaborative learning, students work together in groups of two or more to achieve a common goal. That goal might be solving a problem, completing a task, learning a new concept, or even creating a product. During this time, students are expected to be demonstrating active learning and take responsibility for their own learning. They should also be reflecting throughout the entire collaborative learning experience on things such as their own assumptions and their thought process. So what's the teacher's role in all of this? And what should they be doing during the entire collaborative learning process? In collaborative learning, the teacher acts as more of a facilitator. However, the teacher should still be monitoring students to assess their individual performance and contribution to their group. The teacher may also need to assign group roles in advance, depending on the age of the students and their level of experience with collaborative learning. So what are the benefits of collaborative learning? Most importantly, collaborative learning fosters the development of essential 21st century skills that are vital in real life social and employment situations. These skills include collaboration, critical thinking and problem solving, communication, self-management, and leadership skills. Additionally, students become active partners in the learning experience rather than mere passive consumers of knowledge. Instead of simply receiving knowledge from a teacher, they are now creating and discovering that knowledge on their own and with their classmates. The fact that students are actively involved in the learning process increases their overall interest in the entire experience. Why should technology be used to support collaborative learning? Well, for one thing, there are so many benefits. First, it makes sharing, interaction, and collaboration between students much easier. It enables two-way communication and contribution between students. And technology can create a sense of social presence, which is especially important for collaborative learning situations with no in-person interaction. Incorporating technology into collaborative learning can increase student motivation to work and learn, both intrinsically and extrinsically. It also increases student understanding of technology, which can strengthen students' attitudes towards technology in a positive way. Finally, incorporating technology is likely to increase student satisfaction in the end result, product, or outcome of their overall collaborative learning experience. It's likely that you're feeling a bit overwhelmed and don't even know where to begin. But there is no need to worry. There are so many available technology tools out there that are very simple and easy to use. Here are just a few of my favorites to get you started. The first tool I'd like to share with you is Flipgrid. Flipgrid is simple to use and a wonderful tool for building classroom community. With Flipgrid, the teacher posts a topic and students can react and respond to the topic with a short video. Students can also comment and respond to the videos of their classmates. Padlet is a tool for creating bulletin board style web pages that can be easily customized to fit a specific need. Students can create their own posts and engage with peers by leaving comments and likes. With Padlet, students could engage in discussions, share resources for a project, work in groups, and even create collaborative maps. Poplet is a tool for creating My Maps and Flowcharts. They can be created independently or collaboratively, and they can be easily linked, embedded, or downloaded. When the collaborative option is used, the individual popples are labeled with the name of the user that created it, so the teacher can easily see who has participated. The final tool I'd like to share with you is KidBlog, a safe platform for students to publish their writing, audio, visual, or video products. Students can comment on the posts of their peers and provide one another with feedback. They can also share their products with classes and students around the world, which excites students and increases engagement overall. Hopefully by now you have a better understanding of the tremendous benefits of collaborative learning, how technology can be used to support it, 
and feel even more prepared to bring a collaborative learning experience to your classroom. Thank you so much for your time and for viewing my presentation today.